Welcome, top news today. Please subscribe and support this channel. Melania Trump has run into another plagiarism problem. Melania Trump has stolen from Michelle Obama, again. Although she's reportedly married to a man, Donald Trump, who hates Barack Obama, Melania Trump has used her position as First Lady to jack every aspect of Michelle Obama that she can get away with. Of course, the first theft occurred when Melania plagiarized Michelle Obama's speech while speaking at the Republican National Convention in 2016. There was a lot of controversy, but no one on Melania's team was fired and her husband became president. But Melania must have thought that she could get away with stealing again. This time, she has used words from an Obama-era anti-bullying campaign to be included in her Be Best initiative for kids, according to BuzzFeed. Melania basically took the FTC pamphlet published in 2014 and copied the document for her new campaign. The issue is another disastrous and embarrassing moment for the Trump campaign. After being in office for over a year, Trump and his team have yet to make America great. Instead, Trump's presidency has been flawed and marred by scandal. Moreover, Melania apparently did not think twice about her anti-cyberbullying campaign. It will be hard to convince America's kids to speak believe that message when the biggest cyberbully in the nation happens to be the leader of the free world. The First Lady rolled out her Be Best campaign to combat cyberbullying on Monday, and provided attendance at a White House news conference with an informational pamphlet that is nearly identical to a Federal Trade Commission report from 2014. Except for a few minor changes, Melania Trump's talking with kids about being online is a page-by-page -page duplicate of a leaflet titled Netc. Chatting with kids about being online put out by the FTC in January 2014. Stephanie Grisham a spokeswoman for the First Lady, said the White House rapper post the 25-page FTC report because it clearly related to the social media portion of Mrs. Trump's initiatives. It was updated and edited to reflect today's event and we were happy to be able to provide the children in attendance with such a resource, Grisham told the New York Daily News. But the only portions of the First Lady's pamphlet that are updated and edited is the title, the cover page, a few graphics of smartphones and a subhead that now reads sexting, don't do it instead of the Obama-era FTC reports sexting. This is not the first time Melania Trump has found herself in hot water over plagiarism. A speechwriter admitted to accidentally including word-by-word -word sections of a Michelle Obama speech in Melania Trump's address to the Republican National Convention in July 2016. A person she has always liked is Michelle Obama, Trump's speechwriter, Meredith McKiver, said in a statement at the time. Over the phone, she read me some passages from Mrs. Obama's speech as examples. I wrote them down and later included some of the phrasing in the draft that ultimately became the final speech. In addition to the FTC flub, Melania Trump's Be Best Awareness campaign raised some eyebrows since one of its main focuses is combating cyberbullying, behavior her husband is notorious around the world for perpetuating. Please subscribe channel. Thank you for watching.